Hello, hello, America. Welcome to our new show, A Conversation with G. Cole. My name is Miss Gladys Cole, and today we have a very special guest, Charlotte Tibbetts. Hi, everyone. How you doing, Charlotte? Good. You finally got my last name right. I finally got your last name right. So, Charlotte, how old are you? I'm eight years old. Eight years old. When is your birthday? June 23rd. June 23rd. Hopefully you can have a party following the governor's social distancing rules. You can have a celebration. So Charlotte, um, I know you have a mommy and a daddy. Do you know how your parents met? I do. So um, my dad, it's, it's kind of a funny story. My dad was um, at Chili's and he was um, eating and then my mom came up to him at, and he was sitting along with no friends or anything and, he, and my mom said, can I sit with you? And he sh said, sure. And then they sat at the table together and now they're married. Oh, I love that story. So do you know how long they've been married? They've been married for 10 years. Wow, that's so amazing. You have an awesome mommy and a daddy. So Charlotte, what do you want to be when you grow up? Well, um, to get, I have two jobs I want to be. To get up to my main job, I want to be a baker. Okay. And my main job I want to be is an actor because um, I love to act and I want to be on Broadway in front of all those people. Oh, awesome. I know you love acting and stuff. Um, we've done a lot of shows together. Yeah, I, um, have a whole wall, I have a whole wall of the shows we've done. What is maybe one of your favorite characters you have played? My favorite character is probably... I haven't played him yet. I will play him in a, in a future play that I've casted called Moana, and I'm going to be Hey Hey. You might see the binder script in, the, in her background. <laughs> um, but what, um, I know we have that um, Moana coming up in the fall. That is our goal right now. But what character you have already played previously, is there any specific character that was your favorite that you've already played and performed? Maybe, um, that's a hard question. I loved all of the characters I've been. Um, How about a favorite play? What has been your favorite play you've performed in? My favorite play I performed in was The Lion King with Miss Gladys. Oh, The Lion King. That's the first ever play. Yeah, it was a great experience, a great play. Who is the most important man in America, Charlotte? At the moment, it's the President Donald Trump because he's a president. Donald Trump, why is he the most important man in America? Because he's the president. Because he's the president. Um, is there any life before social distancing? My friends, my family. Yeah. Your, uh, what do you miss? Just like spending time? Just spending time with them. Yeah. Is there a, a new hobby that you started doing since you've been home a lot that um, maybe you haven't, you wasn't doing before? So like a hobby or activity that you recently started doing? Painting. I've been painting. You have? Mm -hmm. Do you enjoy it? I do. Why do you enjoy painting? Um, because it's fun. Because it's fun. Oh, that's so awesome. Um, so Charlotte, do you have any brothers or sisters? I have one older brother that's 21 and two younger brothers. Um, one is three and one is, let's see, six in heaven. Oh, okay. So do you like your brothers? I do, but the youngest one can be a little annoying sometimes. <laughs> Because I'm like, oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. No, he's really not. <laughs> <laughs> he really is cute. But brothers are supposed to be annoying sometimes. I think that's part of their job. 
don't think they have a job. <laughs> it's either job to be alive. <laughs> um, so Charlotte, if there was one thing in the world that you could change, what would that one thing be? Coronavirus. Coronavirus. How would you change coronavirus? Would you make um, do some I sort of magic? How would you change that? I would cast a spell. You would cast a spell. And would you make it go to a mountain or? I would make it go out of this universe. Out of this universe. We would all love for you to make it go out of this universe. Definitely. Bring, yeah. <laughs> so um, I know there is a famous person you would love to meet. Can you share with us who that famous person is? Famous person I would like to meet is Duff. From the Ace of Cakes. Oh, why? Wow, why? Because he's my favorite baker. Um, he's a famous baker, and um, one day leading up to being an actor, I want to be a, a baker. And the reason why I'm saying Duff and not Buddy is because Duff is my idol, and Buddy is my worst nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> um. So Charlotte, I heard that you wrote a little parody song. I did. You did. What is the name of your song? The parody I did was Wouldn't It Be Nice. Okay. And um, I believe it's from um, the original song, um, The Beach Boys, correct? Correct. Um, can you sing a little bit of your parody for us? I can. Okay. Wouldn't it be nice if COVID ended? Then we wouldn't have to wait so long. And wouldn't it be nice to see each other in the kind of world where we be one? You know, it's gonna make it so much better when we can see our friends and hang together. Oh, wouldn't it be nice if we could wake up in the morning when the day is new? After having months of isolation, hold each other close the whole day through. All the happy times we've been spending on Google Meet seems never ending. Oh, wouldn't it be nice? Awesome job. Thank you. <laughs> I love it. Such a great song. Well, thank you so much for joining me today, Charlotte. Thank you so much for having me. I miss you so much during this pandemic. I miss you too, but I'm glad we get to spend time during our theater classes and rehearsals and give each other virtual hugs. Oh. Oh, wouldn't it be nice if we can hug instead of hugging our computers right now? And wouldn't it be nice if COVID said goodbye? I'm going to fly up in the sky and disappear in the atmosphere. Wouldn't it be nice? <laughs> it doesn't beat mine, though. <laughs> hey have you made a parody say it for us i have not made a parody but you have inspired me to make a parody actually you inspired me by super bad transmittable contagious off of fire <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much charlotte bye bye, bye people bye people bye people bye people mm, bye 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 when you leave I probably won't even notice.